turn to our distinguished ranking member, Mr. Jordan, for his opening statement. Mr. Chairman, <clears throat> thank you. Uh, this is a critical hearing on a critical issue. Congressional oversight on this issue, I think, is of paramount importance. Um, and I do want to thank you, because this committee has a history of working in a bipartisan manner when it comes to civil liberties, when it comes to privacy rights, and you've been a champion on that, and I, I applaud your efforts, and I'm glad that we have got this nice panel to have a um, good discussion this morning. A few years ago, we had uh, a hearing on um, Stingray technology. I think some of you were at that hearing, if I remember uh, correctly. But this is a technology where um, you have this device, and instead of people's cell phones going to the tower, it actually bounces off this device, and folks, government, can get your cell number and, frankly, know exactly where you're standing. And as the chairman mentioned, the, the potential for mischief when you think about folks exercising their First Amendment liberties at some kind of political rally, whether it's on the right or the left, as the chairman talked about, I think is, is scary. We learned in that hearing also that the IRS was actually involved in using this technology. Same IRS that a few years ago targeted people for their political beliefs. We found that, we found that very scary. Stop and think then, not just the cell phone now, but actual facial recognition in real-time video, as the chairman talked about. That is a scary thought. That is 1984 George Orwell, Orwell kind of um, scenario that I think troubles us, uh, troubles us all. So I, am, I appreciate this hearing. Um, I'm glad that we're going to hear from our witnesses and get a chance to talk about this important subject and how as the chairman said, it is virtually unregulated, but I think that, frankly, um, frankly needs to change. And so with that, Mr. Chairman, I would yield back, and I look forward to hearing from our witnesses in the discussion that will ensue.